In this tutorial, you will be learning how to import a standard drawing layout from a PDF file to a CAD drawing file. Standard drawing layout is somewhat permanent on your drawing, which is in this case you have your on this portion and then you have the margins. Na? Uh, this is where we put the different plans in uh, multidisciplinary area such as architectural, structural, sanitary or plumbing, electrical, mechanical, etc. I got this file from this website, bagyo.gov.ph, uh, content, city buildings and architecture office downloadable files or forms. If you go down, uh, this is where you you get the documents available on the uh, available form in acquiring a building permit but apparently the files is no longer available here and uh, I think they remove it and I do not know the reason why but anyway we go with the uh, AutoCAD I'm using AutoCAD 2018 uh, I go with template ACAD ISO DWT. ACAD ISO DWT has a units in millimeter. So if I will try to check my units, that should be in millimeter. Okay, you go to the backstage view of your CAD. Go to import and then click on PDF. So this will pop up. Just hit enter or the space bar. Then get the directory or find the directory of your file and then open. Then just go with the uh, standard uh, page import. So hit OK. So you have now this file uh, from the PDF file to your CAD drawing. Okay, so what you need to do is clean up this mess because if you try to look there are overlapping lines uh, this is this would be your job already so you might as well clean up your layers so I will go with my layers okay and then there I have uh, two four five I have five available layers coming from your, the PDF so I will just create a new one Let's say line, then come up with another color, and then a thickness probably of 0 0.05, hit OK. Then select all the drawings, you go with your layer line, and then perch your drawing. Perch it all to clean the unnecessary layers. So check your layers okay so let's try to check the size of this standard drawing available to us DLI so it looks uh, 420 millimeter And then 297 millimeter. Okay, so I am facing now a, an A3 sheet, but of course you need to remove this one. Uh, remove the names. Baka makasuwan tayo dito, no? You try to remove the names. Okay, so I will scale this one to 100. Okay, so that I will now be on the scale of 1 is to 100. Now, every time I will draw certain figures na, or any type of drawing, now your drawing must now be from 1 meter converting that one to a 1000 millimeter. Okay, so for you to plot this one, you go to the layout, 
we create another paper right click then go to page setup manager okay i will hit a new one okay then uh, call this one as a3 then new you can type any name to that hit ok and from the printer platter you go to the dwg to pdf and then properties okay custom paper size and then add a new one you start from scratch probably next and then the width would be 420 and then this one would be 297 yeah Okay, and then millimeter and then hit next and then all of my drawing paper should be printable so i will put the margin as zero and then put this one as a3 dash new so 420 by 297 next finish hit ok and then hit ok uh, I will try to modify, I will go back because I did not choose the paper. I'll go on the upper side. Okay, there is the A3 new 420. Now this the, there is in an A3 already here. Na? But the margins on the printable area is not 0, 0. So I created another one that is 0, 0. Which is this part. So hit OK. And then uh, you can put this, you can double click this one. Okay, what is important is we we come up with a new paper. Huh? You go to the model, you plot it out, control plot. Okay, and then DWG to PDF, you go with the, that paper that we created. Okay, not fit to paper, the scale is 1 is to 100 center plot okay then we go with window select this portion select this portion then hit ok landscape then go to monochrome okay then hit ok or you can preview no hit continue and then save let's say we save that one as that name then there you have now your A3 sheet of band paper. Okay, so the drawings must now be in from a conversion from meter to a millimeter. Okay, so thanks for watching. I hope this will help you.